First on five, caught in a rip current. A dangerous day to be in the water down in Perdido Key. As WKRG News 5's Cody Long reports, several people jumped in to help people in distress. A beautiful day at the beach turned into a fight to save lives in Perdido Key. Four people here on vacation were caught in a rip current. They got pulled out and then they got pulled a little bit further and then that's when panic set in and they started calling. Two children and a man were airlifted to hospitals, all in critical condition. Another child in serious condition was taken by ambulance. This is an unguarded portion of uh, Perdido Key where there aren't any lifeguards. Um, so we're strictly dependent upon the firefighters. Dee Valley and her 15 year old daughter Bryn are visiting from Atlanta. They both have lifeguard training. They grabbed some boogie boards and jumped into action. You hope you train your whole life and never have to use it, but it's nice that you know you have the knowledge so you can use it if you can. Dee and Bryn split ways. Dee and another woman went to help the man. He needed help, so we held him up. The waves were knocking us over, and I just tried to do everything I could to keep his face out of the water. Bren helped a young boy and got him out of the gulf. So then I put him on the board, and then I drove him to shore, and I put him in the rescue position. It's like on your side, which I was taught in lifeguarding. Yellow flags were flying at the time and were later changed to red. As beautiful as the beaches are, uh, if you see waves that are over your head or at least chest high, uh, I would stay out of the water. Uh, the rip currents are horrendous here. They're quick. 